Ukrainian armed forces captured the Russian Vitiaz DT-30. The video of the carrier was published on social media. The authors of the video did not indicate exactly where the captured vehicle was, but it is known that in the armed forces of the Russian Federation they entered service with 200th Motorized Rifle Brigade, which is currently fighting near Avdiivka. The Vitiaz DT-30 is a multi-purpose articulated tracked carrier developed in the Soviet Union. It was designed to carry heavy loads in difficult terrain like swamps, sand and snow in extreme weather conditions. In late 1981, trials of the DT-30P and DT-32 unit ATVs were completed. These trials were carried out in severe weather and terrain conditions in various military districts and demonstrated that the vehicles possessed high cross-country ability and load-carrying capacity, and could be used effectively to transport military hardware and non-military equipment in severe climatic conditions of the northern part of Russia, in Siberia, and Far East, as well as in the desert. Eventually their performance was found superior to demands, as they outperformed all Russian-made and foreign vehicles of this class. Today, Vitiaz CTVs are in use throughout the whole territory of Russia, as well as in Arctic and Antarctica. They are an invaluable part of the transport services for prominent companies such as Gazprom JSC, Rosneftegazstroy, Rosneftegaz JSC, etc. They serve as primary transport vehicles for the personnel who service the oil and gas pipelines throughout Russia, for geologists and scientists who research the remote and isolated regions. For different industries were produced several specialized versions, DT-30K crane, DT-30E excavator, refueling vehicles, mobile workshops, mobile oil refineries, passenger transporters, firefighting vehicles. Vehicles of kind are in demand not only in Russia, but throughout the countries of the Middle East and Asia, as well as in North and South America.